Good. How's everybody? Good. Dude, I cannot stop laughing. I got the most, I got the best picture sent to me yesterday, and I don't I haven't seen this app yet. But he sent me a cool picture yesterday, and this goes to show just how much work they were doing yesterday, yeah. because they were fooling like around. Yeah, yeah. What do you see this picture? It, uh, yeah. It's a face swap. Yeah, face swap. It, yeah. Oh, oh man, that is hilarious. Oh, gross. That is weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it just doesn't even look <laughs> right. <laughs> 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 so that's what you guys were doing. It took you so long to finish yesterday, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to tell Tamara. Yeah, yeah. All right, today's job is Cook Veterinary Clinic. Um, I, we've done work for them before. I remember, yeah, same place. Then. That's like several years ago. Yeah, right yeah, we did some offices. Yeah. Uh, a couple of offices for them, yeah. So it's a commercial job. They're coming back, and we're doing, I mean, it's a big room. Of course, you guys remeasured it. And so Mike has got everything ready to. It shows that we're covering up some windows. Yes. Or part of windows or something like that. Yeah. And didn't you say there could be a problem with that? Yeah. Um, if you look on the one page on that wall where there is a uh, pass through window here, that's, that's actually a metal casing that sticks out about um, almost a full inch out of the wall. So we're going to have to devise a way uh, to build around that because that's going to um, keep us yeah, from building directly it against it. Also. They're completely covering the window. Completely covering it. Yep. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Once the wall talker isn't in place, and that's backed, or there's doors in front of it. So, yeah, that's going to be totally covered. We've got two days on this, so if you run into some problems, if you you know figuring out that window, um, I'm sure Mike can work it out and. What kind of specialty work do we have on this, Mike? Uh, there's two laminate tops, there's wall talkers. Actually, to me, how y'all are gonna fit all this stuff in the room that is going in, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it'll surprise me. Because right. they're doing all new file drawers, everything, just to put all their stuff back there. Yeah. So. Oh, okay. are, are we actually yeah. building a wall out of our unit? Yeah, on the one wall, they're actually gonna use our backing. That's actually gonna be the wall, the separation wall, yeah. Okay. So there's cool. a lot of wall talkers, there's lighting. Um, the okay. laminate tops are, are really big tops. Yeah, y'all have to figure out where the grommets and stuff go. Because, you know, they're talking about moving their computers and all that. So. Okay. And they're cool. seamed, seamed tops you got with the designer and figured out where the seams were going to be on the tops. I mean, that's the really nice thing about us building in, you know, all the tops in ourselves. We can figure that stuff out and... So, cool. okay, any questions? No, appreciate it. Be good. Should be good to go. Two days on it, so you know, let me know. Yeah, what I mean. yeah. Two days. Half so, day. yeah, 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 yeah. Half day the first yeah. day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Next. Everybody work safe. Let's roll. <laughs> Let's take care of this client, the repeat All right. clients. All right, sounds All right. good. Okay. <laughs>
uh, new clients filling out papers and things like that. So we've got a lot of his medical history, paperwork, and things like that that we wanted to be able to reorganize. Um, We've also wanted to have um, like task lighting um, so that we could actually have more than just the fluorescent lights with us, um, you know, which is a little un un unruly when you're trying to work with white paper and computer screens and stuff like that. So I think it's gonna be a nicer approach to that. And then um, I was really excited about the wall talkers because we were taping things to the wall and it'll be nicer to have, uh, to have that availability to have push pins and again, organized. I'm really, really excited to be able to have closed cabinets and drawers and shelves and um, there's just going to be so many options for me to put things, so it'll be nicer. Hey, good morning. We're here at Cook Veterinary Clinic. we got a big day ahead of us. we got some office units to put together, a bunch of file drawers, a lot of locks on the doors, some lighting. So it's going to be a full day. we got to get started now. Let's go, man. What's really cool about this room in particular is that it's exactly what they want just for this space. So uh, while not all office centers are the same, this is particularly very, very custom to their special needs. As you can see there's like, I think there's over 20 file drawers in this place. So there's a lot of filing, there's going to be a lot of locks put on. Uh, there's going to be some really cool what we call wall talkers, which is some, a pegboard, kind of like a thing for offices. Uh, so it's really cool. I don't think we've done that yet. Um, so it's going to be really cool how that ties in. And like I said, it's basically the same color as the previous units. So I think it's going to tie in really well with the rest of the, uh, the office. So Mike's been keeping an eye on me, so which is nice. <laughs> right? I wanted to show you something real quick. I just got off the phone with Mike. Apparently, whomever in the computer put it in, as you can see, the door is correct, but like the old Sesame Street, one of these things is not like the other. <laughs> oh! Yeah. yeah. Did you already call him? Yes, I just called. Cool. What did so, he say? Cool. Well, it wasn't us. It was just put in the computer like that, so we put it in upside down. Okay. So, you know, so no. did you know which one to cut now? Yes. I said, do I need to give you the measurements? And he goes like, no, it should be still on the computer. I just told him, just don't put any hardware holes in it at all. We'll do it out here. Just remake the door. Oh, okay. You know, so. Well, are you sure we can't use the same yeah. door? <laughs> <laughs> well, the, the problem would be, I mean, conceivably, I could take an inch and three quarter hole saw and pop those out and we'll just go ahead and put the door like that where it's supposed to be. And then we could say that that is a, a feature, actually, you know, like a pass-through. And they could, like, put, like, like, birds or pet rodents. Or, or uh, I was going to say hamster, right? That sort of thing. Courtney and I'm a design consultant with Closet Factory and I've been here for almost six months. So on one of my first uh, client appointments, uh, Sharon sent me all the information for her address and her telephone number, but it was missing the condo unit number. She lived in a condominium and I didn't know that until uh, I got there and unfortunately I was calling the client but her phone was off so she didn't know I was calling her and so I was like, well, she's 
got to be in here somewhere. So I just went and started knocking door to door with all of my like 800 design equipment bags, just every door. Hi, are you Miss Jackson? No. <laughs> and yeah, I felt a little bit like an idiot. And by, by the time I finally found her, I'm pretty sure I like scared the daylights out of her because, you know, I knocked on the door and by this point I'm like sweating because it's 100 degrees outside and look disgusting. I'm like, are you Miss Jackson? And she was like, yeah. I was like, oh my God, you are? And I like jumped. <laughs> I was so excited. So it was, it was an interesting experience, <laughs> but a good story. I think she was thinking I was a little over the top, but it worked out really well. She actually ended up calling me to do a second project in her house after that, so she knew I was dedicated. <laughs> yeah, she's really sweet, sweetest lady. Hello, I'm Mike Burkett. I'm the operations manager at the Plaza Factory, and today we're gonna to talk about the Cook Veterinarian Medical Center over in uh, Greenbrier. Actually, this was a kind of a trying unit because we had to get enough file drawers and locks for all of their files that they just had stacked um, boxes and stacked in the closets and everything else. So we actually did two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. There's actually almost 25 file drawers that we put in the cocks. And between the side locks that we put in, um, the cam locks and the doors, they wanted just about everything locked. Uh, one side we did a desk. Um, it's just a melamine top, but we did task lighting up under the upper cabinets over top of the desk. That way they can just flick the switch. They have lights to work on because a couple of them sit there with their laptops and you know do all the records of all the dogs and cats that come into the clinic. We actually did wall talkers behind the desk also. Um, wall talker is actually a soft cork. That way they can put pins and notes and anything up behind their desk. We actually put a little desk right as you walk into the door to the uh, left hand side. We put a little desk with a fax machine right there. That way the lady from out front, she can just walk in, reach in, grab the fax and she doesn't have to go all through the office and find out where which machine it actually came from. So we put her one right there by the door. They have a lot of files that they want to keep locked up that certain employees aren't privy to. So just about all the drawers on the desk had side locks. Um, five of the cabinets had the cam locks on the doors, so all the doors locked. So they can feel secure when they actually leave the office and they need that time. The first thing that I wanted to place is the fax machine for Phyllis, who is the administrator. She likes to just run into this office and grab her faxes right off the machine inside the door. So we'll go ahead and set that up for her. I've asked them how deep they want their desktops and how high they want their countertops. So I've allowed for that. We have file drawers for storage with cabinetry above. We've covered the window that overlooks into the lobby, so no one from the lobby will be able to see the shelving and all of the stuff that was previously stacked on it. They can hide all of their goodies in this cabinet over here. Dr. Marr is gonna be over in a corner where clients will not see her so easily as they're walking through the lobby. She's got plenty of storage. They have a cabinet now for their computer software. Have Marcy's area with the you can't tell on the CAD program but there's going to be a piece of backing on this wall here so that sound won't penetrate through and it also will provide some privacy for Marcy when she's working we have plenty of drawer storage L shelves Phyllis's desk is going to sit right over here next to the light switch she will be thrilled and then more lateral file storage, and it's gonna be a beautiful space. We're almost done with the structure completely. We have to bring this top in first before we finish off this upper section, because that actually sits on the top, so. 
As soon as I get done with that wall talker in that area, Mike and I will bring the other top over here and get that set. So after that, it's basically just putting on the locks. There's some locks that go on some of these doors and some of these drawers. Uh, it's indicated on the plans and we'll be installing those and the hardware, obviously, but the hard part's almost done. <laughs> You want to push it into yeah. the bottom? Yeah. We're, so we're going to bypass all that other stuff right there. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if it's going to get completely past the ray fixes. Well, we'll it'll. See first. Yeah, it should be. It should be enough malleability, if you will, there. for that to happen. I just, yeah, we should be able to. This to me would be more concerning than anything else. Okay, hold up, hold up. Real quick, hold up, hold up. I got it over here. In some cases, it looks like. You think it'll go? It'll just go. Why? Well, let's just take this one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, there's this ray fix right here. Are we good in the corner? Oh, yeah, you're as tight as All can right. be in the corner. Ready? Uh huh. A little more. The rescue mission. Thank you, sir. What's Mike got there carrying up? Oh, you never know with Mike, man. There he is. Look, he got his sunglasses on. Look at that. He got out there at the beach, ain't you, Mike? Yeah, I just got back. <laughs> Oh my goodness. This is amazing. It looks so much bigger. Oh my gosh. <gasps> we went up taller. Yes. So it took, yeah, it took a lot out of the middle of the room. This is great. It's amazing. Do you already know where you're gonna put like everything? Oh my gosh, I think I was asked earlier who's gonna go, who's gonna put the first thing in, and uh -huh. I, th I think everybody's excited. So I think everybody's <laughs> gonna be ready to put things in. This is great. This is amazing. So let's take a tour. Okay. First and foremost, okay. Phyllis's fax machine. Nice. She can just pop her head in the door and okay. grab anything that she wants as it comes out. Perfect. So this desk has the drawers. You've got two pencil drawers right under okay. the countertop. Here we have file drawers. <laughs> Your lateral file drawers, at least part of them. Yes, okay. Have well, them. they and they match and, and they, they match. <laughs> <laughs> You have your cabinetry up okay. here with shelving inside. Oh, I love the handles. I love the, the feel it. of everything. They, they feel so good. I think these are going to be like my new favorite handles. I really like them. I do too. Yeah, we had a couple different ones to go through before we found those, so that was nice. It was a good choice. Yes, it was. Looks great. And then back over here, we have the cold room. Okay. So this wall will provide a sound barrier. Okay. I think that's really going to help. It's really going to help. And privacy. With that. Yeah. Good. Very nice. So coming around here to your area. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be so great. I can't wait to get my, my stuff in here. And Plenty of storage. I know. Oh, my gosh. We've Look at that. Vertical dividers. Okay. So you can have additional storage in there for things, maybe file folders or things that you want standing upright. Okay, that is great. And if you ever want to order shelves, you can because okay. you've got the holes drilled every inch and a quarter so you can plug those in there and change it as you okay. change. Okay, that's perfect. Everything is adjustable. So these shelves here are on steel supports. Okay. You can move these, you can move that one up there. Okay, very nice. These are locked in. Okay. Same thing with these shelves over in here. They're adjustable. Okay. You just move them. Okay, that's great that I can take a drawer out or, or you know, a shelf out or 
anything like that. That's great. And in here too. Oh, good. Okay. And that is going to be great. If you want your shelves closer together, mm -hmm. again, just call me. We can manufacture extras. Okay. Okay. Great. You have your cabinets here for your computer storage. Okay. Here so they block them. So okay. There. And there's a touch latch. Oh, that's nice. So okay. The side. Okay. That's why we only have to have one key. Oh, okay. So Otherwise, each door would need its own. Right. Over here, we have Dr. Mars corner. Okay. She has her drawers, locks just like yours. Very nice. She's got her cabinetry. Okay. Her dividers. She she's gonna love the storage there. That's great. Her own task lighting. Okay. With the dimmer switch. Good. Like Keys on her drawers. Okay. Grommet holes so that the cords drop through. Okay, perfect. That'll be easy. There's another surge protector. I keep calling them surge protectors. Another power strip. Okay. Right here. Okay. And then we've covered the window. Oh, good. Okay. Perfect. I, I think that took a lot of uh, space, you know, availability with that window it that did. we didn't even use. So that that's great. Use. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And anyone who looked in here from the lobby mm -hmm. saw a mess. Yes. So yes, they did. No more messes. It's good. All private now. Good. The other half of your file drawers. Okay. Very nice. This is so nice. I love the setup. More shelves. Okay. And then, yeah. Oh, this is great. I can't, I can't wait <laughs> to put things in here and just to be able to organize things. We've had a lot of overflow elsewhere <laughs> for everything. I'm so. sure that you have. <laughs> and then back here in this corner, it's just a section of shelving for you. Oh, that is awesome. Okay, good. I, I think I have plans for this already. More storage <laughs> than you've ever had. Yes, this is so much, so much more. And it's more than I could have imagined. This is great. This is amazing. And it looks really good with your door. Yes, I, I like thought the way so the too. Wood grains complement one another. Right, yeah. And I was trying to match the um, the floor uh, outside because we just got those, you know, put in, and then the walls, and I wanted it to be, um, you know, kind of calming and uh, more natural. Well, this is, you know, Dr. Cook practices Chinese medicine. I know. <laughs> so who would have yes. thought acupuncture for animals? Right. So it's a very zen-like. And that's what exactly what I was going for. That's yeah. exactly what I was hoping for because, I mean, we're, we're here a lot. We're, we're in here and we're, we're here a lot. So it would be nice to be homey and, um, you that's know, right. more comfortable. This is great. It's perfect. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I can't believe it's done. It, it really wrapped up really quickly. They were um, very neat and they were efficient. They cleaned up everything. Uh, I mean, it just looks it just looks amazing. Very happy with it. I think it's everything and more. I didn't expect to have so much floor space now. I didn't expect to have, because what we, what we came from, we were all on top of each other and we were having to step over each other to kind of get in and out of this desk and in and out of this drawer and, and things like that. Um, so I think now there's gonna actually be enough room for three working individuals in here. And the room looks so much bigger. So I think it's, it's definitely more than I expected. We'll definitely call Closet Factory again. We've, we've already had one great experience with them and now we have all of this. So I think it's amazing. We'll definitely recommend them also. So it's been another great day. The job turned out fabulously. The guys did an awesome job with the installation. The design, if I must say so, was brilliant. And I'm just really pleased with the way that it turned out. So another happy client. Now I hope dinner is ready for me when I get home. All right, we're all finished with the install today. Uh, the office looks great. There's a lot more storage inside. Uh, we were able to overcome a few problems like uh, the door, uh, the uh, surprise such as the uh, outlets through the wall talkers. But as usual, you know, we were able to soldier through. Able to get through it, man. That's Absolutely, it. you know, that's that's what we do. And the uh, pets are going to be happy. Exactly. All their files are going to be yeah, in order. All the files Somebody's will be in order. Somebody's not going to be getting a shot that they're not supposed to. Do. Yeah, none of that will happen. Exactly. No accidental neutering. Yeah, yeah exactly. Fantastic. That'll be the important part. So let's go, man. All let's right, man. Let's, let's go. Dude, right. no, you handed out awards yesterday and everything. Yes. Yeah, we handed out awards. Probably two of the, well, well there could only have been I two got out the of the three were sitting. I got the most gracious installer, of course. And, then, the most, he, and he got the most positive. He got the most positive. The most positive. He turns those frowns upside down. <laughs>